Bush Senior groped 16 year old. Roslyn Corrigan told Time magazine that she was 16 when Bush allegedly grabbed her buttocks as she posed for a photo with him in 2003 at a gathering of CIA officers north of Houston. She attended the event with her mother and father, who was an intelligence analyst. My initial action was absolute horror. I was really, really confused, she told the magazine. Related, Bush apologizes after sexual assault allegations. Former U.S. President George H.W. Bush has been accused of sexually harassing a 16-year-old. Picture, of source AFP. The first thing I did was look at my mom and, while he was still standing there, I didn't say anything. What does a teenager say to the ex-president of the United States? Like, hey dude, you shouldn't have touched me like that? Apostrophe. As soon as the picture was being snapped on the 123 he dropped his hands from my waist down to my buttocks and gave it a nice, ripe squeeze, which would account for the fact that in the photograph my mouth is hanging wide open. I was like, oh my goodness, what just happened? Corrigan said some people were dismissive when she recounted the tale, but she was encouraged to speak out after other women came forward with allegations of sexual harassment against Mr. Bush. I don't know, maybe it never really hit people that I was a child at the time and that goes beyond a guy being inappropriate in the workplace to appear or somebody in his age range, she said. I was a child. Corrigan said she immediately told her mother sorry what had happened. Corrigan is at least the fifth woman to allege Mr. Bush groped her. The allegations came to light after Heather Lind claimed last month she was touched inappropriately by the ex-president. Source supplied. When he left, my daughter Rosie said, he grabbed me on the rear end. And I said, what, what? Sorry told time. And she said, yes, he grabbed me when they were taking the picture. He grabbed me on my butt. And I was like, oh my god, are you kidding me? I was really, really upset she was very upset, she was really, really mad, she added. Sorry said she would have tried to take action had it been just some Joe Blow or something. I'd probably chase him down and yell at him.
But, you know, it's the president. What are you supposed to do? She said. And you've got your husband's job that could be in jeopardy. I mean, you just didn't then. You should you should have always spoken up, always but we didn't. A spokesman for the 41st president, Jim McGraw, said in a statement that Bush regrets any offensive actions. George Bush simply does not have it in his heart to knowingly cause anyone distress, and he again apologizes to anyone he offended during a photo op, he said. Time spoke with seven people who said they had been told by Corrigan about the encounter and the years afterward. Former President George H. W. Bush is confined to a wheelchair due to vascular Parkinsonism. Picture, AP Source App. Corrigan is at least the fifth woman to say Bush groped her. Time reports that a sixth woman, a retired journalist in Pennsylvania, posted to Facebook last month that Bush touched her from behind during a 2004 photo opportunity. The stories came to light after television actress Heather Lind said last month that Bush, now 93, touched her from behind and told a dirty joke while they were posing for a 2014 photo. McGraw at the time explained that Bush has been in a wheelchair for about five years so his arm falls on the lower waist of people with whom he takes pictures. Bush, who served as president from 1989 to 1993, has vascular Parkinsonism, a rare syndrome that mimics Parkinson's disease, and he uses a wheelchair for mobility. To try to put people at ease, the president routinely tells the same joke and on occasion, he has patted women's rears in what he intended to be a good-natured manner, McGraw said.